Is that gonna wreck me? No, it shouldn't. It shouldn't. Um, we, 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 I believed you, and then you said it twice. We are stepping out of out of Andy Schrock's comfort zone today, and I really appreciate you. Comfort being zone. Here. Wait, you didn't. It's it's hot. It's yeah. I mean yeah, it's hot. But okay. I, I I feel like you're going to survive. Like this is not lime lament. This is back that's back there, which is ounce for ounce the yep. hottest thing I've ever had in the entire planet. This is the thing that I have at my house, and when I have friends over that like spicy food, and I'm like, and I want to challenge them a little bit. This is what I give them. You give them cranberry marmalade? No, I give them tinctures made by Jay Small Batch. So this is when okay, it comes to tincture. Right. Tincture is extremely spicy because that's what it's meant yep. to do, but it's also flavor forward. Okay. I'm so, not, dude. I'm not a fan of. The concept of tinctures. I know you're not. This like, is why you're here. It's like the, maybe in Willy Wonka's chocolate factory, I'd be okay to give to get a drop of something. Anywhere else, I don't want a drop of something. I want like I, a bowl of something. I understand. Right. And this is, I, okay. the, uh, the goal of this video would just be to like there is some some place where someone you could say that some place or someone would enjoy this. Not like maybe I actively hate everything ha in my life right now. Can I just openly roast it so that everyone's just up to par on like what I? Yes. <laughs> okay. Absolutely. So it's like, all right, I'm going to put a, I'm going to, or, or say it's delicious. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like this is delicious and it's going to be delicious specifically right here. <laughs> this is super hot and it's going to ruin that one part of your tongue. Like I, it's good for, okay. You can add it to dirt. You can use it for in cocktails. That's a one element for it. So you can use it for desserts. I put this on ice cream, like a couple dots on ice cream, which I think is fantastic. And it's also a really good way for a tolerance builder. This is a great way to do it. And okay. this is some of the more flavor forward stuff is, at the same time. And it's also like, it's super craft made and it's, it's, it's good stuff. I definitely get it as like a food additive. That's like completely, I'm, I'm on board. It's um, beautiful in cocktails. Like you make a margarita yeah. or a Negroni well, that, like then with that this. goes into the drink. That, that's fine. Yeah, that makes it works, sense. It works great for that. But I love Jay Smallbatch. Like he sent me stuff randomly, which was very nice, and I loved it all. He gave me a tincture. I was like, "Get, I like that's." Yeah, honest. you gave you gave it to me. I gave it to you. Okay, I was like, it's, "Or it's still in my cabinet." You gave it to me. Yeah. Okay, this is made from ginger beer. So he says we craft it. We carefully age a ginger, ginger bear, ginger beer. Wow, for over a ginger bear, <laughs> it's a redheaded bear, <laughs> for over a year, and then added organic dried cranberries and rosemary to truly give our latest seasonal tincture a one of a kind flavor. And then there's the heat. So this is made with scorpion peppers, which is actually the most annoying, like one of the most annoying peppers of all time. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's the one I had at Braille, right? No, you had a ghost pepper. Ghost pepper. Which is one of my favorite. Oh, yeah, have I had a scorpion pepper? I mean, I've had it in stuff. You've had it in stuff, but yeah. you've never had like a straight up scorpion pepper. Really? Um, okay, so there's multiple ways that you can do it. You have a variety of things in front of you. Those spoons are clean. The plastic spoon is definitely clean. Oh, I'll do one of these. Or you can go like Wait, off, off your hand. Yeah, which I'm is not going to do the little, I'm not going to tincture it on my tongue. I, I go off my hand because you're not tincturing unless you physically burn yourself simultaneously. Yeah. Um, also, a good way to feel like you're doing drugs. Yeah, there you go. Or you, maybe that's like coming from someone that's like virtually never done drugs, and but like it's like, it might be that like that guy doesn't do drugs, but that's what he thinks, you know. Yeah. But it's a, it's a little druggy. It's very it's, it's very <laughs> druggy looking. It's a, so it says it's supposed to you're supposed to do one drop. I'm doing one drop. Is that gonna wreck me? No, it shouldn't. It shouldn't. Um, we, 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 I believed you, and then you said it twice. Yeah, because I've never had this. Uh, stay rosy. Uh, shake well before use. Okay. I did that. You see it? Yeah, you, you right can't. There. Oh, there it is. There's there it is. the shine. There's my, um, there's the my. ingredients are sugar, dried cranberries, ginger, scorpion pepper, balsamic vinegar, water, rosemary, and grain alcohol. Yeah, you also picked like the fl one flavor that, like, you know what? This is. I think Andy would hate everything about this. You don't like ginger? I like cr I like ginger beer. I like cranberry. I don't. But like cranberry rosé and hot. It's not rosé, it's rose. Cranberry rose and hot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I do. Like, um, there could have been a million other, like, hot sauce, like, heat can you see my qualifiers. Hair? Okay. Flavors, flavor profiles that would be great. Even the lime. Two. Is that, that has to be the thumbnail. You putting that on your hand. Like, if I saw that in the YouTube, I'd be like, why is he doing that? What's going on? You gotta eat it off your hand, man. All right, I'm doing five. All right, cheers. I don't know. I guess I did one, right? Well, that I mean, is so delicious. I, I, There's no way you're, ten, you're, you're feeling taste, any heat at all. No, no. It comes later. It's definitely floral. I get that. I get sweetness. Well, I, I, get ra I get raspberry, cranberry. I also get the ginger. I out. tasted more wood. Really? Yeah. We, I will really. I don't even know how you made that pronunciation. Dude, but I, I know. I did. I mean, it wasn't that hot. I guess I could do more. Yeah, I'm doing. I uh, definitely another five. But the the parts that did get on there. I did, I did two this time. Uh, <coughs> is it hot? It's a little hotter now. I've done ten drops. It's a little hotter now. Uh, there. Okay. There's a lot of the the fruit stuff. So I, I get sugar. Ginger, I get the ginger. I get the cranberry. 
And then the second There's time around, I get way more heat. I don't taste the peppers though. So the scorpion is like is like a very habanero-y yes. sensation. It's very stabby. Yes. It's but I it's almost like, said it's, bitter, but it's it's not bitter. No, Habana uh, scorpions are like it, it's like the the the, the, the grandfather of, of habaneros. Like so much more brutal. Yeah, I will say that the the J J small batch stuff was like if I needed I there was a few things that he gave me that if I needed to add a little bit just to ramp to heat the meal up perfectly, I, it lasted forever mm -hmm. because it did the job so well. And I feel like that would, if you wanted to make your cheesecake, you know, like a hell cheesecake. <laughs> I like, feel like this actually did burn my skin. Um, that's a thing? I, yeah, it it's, is. It's definitely like, yeah. The, the sides of my tongue are absolutely fine because the nature of, of a dot of, of hot sauce or whatever. But um, it did spread a little bit. I've got it like the, the whole front, exactly where I like licked it, like the whole front of my tongue, yeah. top of my tongue is absolutely on fire right it now. It is. Um, but it's not like affecting, it's not like, since it's such a localized, it's like the rest of my body isn't reacting as much. That's kind of, that's something also I like about tincture. Generally speaking, unless you do like yeah. an exorbitant amount of it, you can get a lot of burn without a lot of like the stomach issues that come with it. Yeah. But if you do enough, you're going to have extreme stomach issues. Like yeah. if I were to chug this bottle, if I were to drink this bottle, like I would like- You would die. You would, it would like completely ruin your life. You would just, it, your your body would evacuate everything. Yes. This <laughs> would be a, this would be a terrible, terrible thing. It <laughs> yeah. could seriously, seriously hurt you. So don't like take a swig of this, like a spoonful no. of this. Like no, 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 no. Like not a thing. But do people do do like, uh, like full droppers of it? Like extreme, the extreme side of it, like that's pretty narps though. I don't want to do that. I, that was pretty crazy for the three drops I did, which is... It's so potently strong. This did not sell me on tinctures at all. It's really unfortunate because... That's a, and no they, hating. I, like, I completely respect everyone. I'm not the type of person that if I have a PlayStation, you have an Xbox, I have to talk trash. Like, I, this is my world and I'm just complaining if it's entertaining, great. If it's not, I mean no offense. It's this is my just, world yeah. and I love this stuff. This is probably... This might be my new favorite tincture that Jay Small Batch has come forward with because I love it because it's so flavor forward. Like there's other tinctures that are extremely on the heat side. Yeah. This is flavor and also has like the heat that I want. Like it's got a lot of heat. I'm gonna be you know d d diving into this like after lunch, all day every day. Just dive right in. What do you, you just do it? You just like it's like that's when you know how you have a problem. You get like, a pocket see, hot sauce. Like. You just see my windowsill. It's yeah. just got tinctures all over the windowsill. Oh. I use we them all the time. We d he's so good at hiding his his addiction that he doesn't. <laughs> He, we don't see him in the corner taking drops of hot sauce. Okay. In the description below is going to be linked to Jay Smallbatch. It's a fantastic company. He does all kinds of stuff. He wants me to try his. He's been begging me. Not begging me. He's been really trying to get me to try his uh, Rock Hill Red, which I've been putting off. Cause is I'm, that the, that's the Carolina Reaper one? Yes. Yeah, that's the one I used all the time, dude, except I had a smaller bottle. Yeah? It, you, it, really? He said, he said he's been, he's like, it's amazing. I'm like, I'm yeah, terrified great. of it. You just put little drops on your meal and you're good. Okay, well, That's there you go. Good. So, mm -hmm. it needs to happen. I told him I was going to do it with this, but I lied to you. I'm sorry I'm not. So, I had like this size bottle of okay. that, and it lasted a long time just because it's just like dip, dip, dip. But it's got a lot of flavor? Uh, I did it for heat. I just did like dips. Okay. I mean, like what I was eating, it was like, it's pretty hard to overtake a flavor on like edamame noodle. Yeah. Three, right. the Skyline Chili three way, yeah, you know, right. something like that. Yeah, like, you're right. Okay, link in the description to that. Also, link to Taco Game Time, our gaming channel that we do together. We have a lot of fun on there. We're doing do. new things all the time, so check that out. All the time. Okay, hope you enjoyed. See you guys on the next. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going <laughs> to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.